So if you're trying to help your students stay organized or even your own child uh, during this coronavirus outbreak, uh, one great tool that we could use is Google Keep. Uh, in fact, I'm using this with my own kids. If you go right here to Google Keep or you simply go to keep.google.com, uh, it's your virtual post-it note app. Uh, so when you click on this, you can click create a note. Uh, and so you can give it a title right here. So we'll just call this to-do list. And um, what we'll also do, whoops, is uh, we'll add some different uh, tasks right here. So what I've suggested to my own children is to show check boxes and to add a list of all of their different subjects. So for example, you know, maybe we have social studies, uh, science, um, math, LA, um, maybe there's a, a business class that they have, art class, music. Okay, so let's say that this is their, their to-do list. I'm just gonna hit um, close. And so uh, each day what I'm asking my kids to do is I'm asking them to actually go through and list some of their assignments. So, you know, teachers are sending things all over the place, especially in our middle school and high school kids. They have like six, seven different subjects to keep track of, and that can be very difficult. So one of the things that I'm um, suggesting to my middle school daughter is to use these three, three boxes right here to make a copy, okay? And I made a copy just for today. So this is gonna be my to-do list today for Friday, okay? And today is, I um, can't believe it's April 3rd. All right, so then what I ask her to do is I ask her to go through and just put together what she's supposed to do that day because you know her social studies class, uh, they might have to do a flip grid and then her science class, they may actually have to go to Moodle and then her math class, they may have to go to Google Classroom and complete problems. So you know, a lot of schools, they just, they're using all sorts of different resources and it's so hard to keep track. So what then my daughter can do is she can go through this list and as she's checking things off, okay she can see those things being checked off right here uh, and then oops if i have to go back i have to go back right here so uh, google keep is a great way uh, for our kids and even our teachers to stay organized uh, once again i just created this template right here so on monday what they can do is they can just go right in here and they can just make a copy of the same old note and now they can do stuff on monday they want to get rid of these notes uh, they can just simply go right here and they can just um, actually delete the note and it'll go away uh, but that at least will help our kiddos stay organized